Hey guys, it's Turbo Kyle here, and I'm back with another video on cars. And today I'm going to be racing as the fabulous Hudson Hornet, Doug Hudson, in the this piston. This is cup. gonna feel great. I'm ready. Alright, and we are racing at Palm Mile Speedway. Here we go. Doug Hudson in the Piston Cup coming out of retirement for one more race. That's and a really here's good Doug Hudson, uh, Same as the last arcade video. We're doing this on uh, champion difficulty. Oh, I almost got taken well out there. Show, no go. Which is not nice for us. Lap 1 out of 12, obviously. Uh, 12 laps the standard. A little bit over the second half away from the lead. And we have already moved ourselves up into almost 4th place. Ow. And luckily this track is wide, allows for keeping the throttle and flat down constantly, which should really help us actually. Because and it's is handling Cam and it's in great section dust, 32. which is you quite just won three in my opinion. Days at the but yeah, now we can just like floor down the outside traffic. A bit of an issue, but we can go around them or we're going to go up into the wall, but it doesn't Ow. slow us down too much. Funny enough, the guy first, the car first slowed us down a lot. You can and already up at the second on the second good, lap. Uh, first place, fun, right? Oh, cars oh, left no, we're and gonna right. go up the No, we're going to keep it. And yeah, first place right in front of us. Or the second lap already in second. Whoa, it was God takes a car out. That takes us oh. out. Oh, and we was going to take it out again. What's going on? But yeah, being able to keep our, our pedal to the metal, hey, doing a little corner cutting there, which is racer. nice. We pull the handbrake a bit, kind of slow us down a lot, but we definitely make a corner. Puts us back down to place, but honestly, it's fine because we're able to keep our pedal to the metal, able to keep our foot on the gas pedal for so long that nothing really slows us down. We've got more speed than anyone on the track. Basically, we want to build up and use the car on the Doug outside Hudson to help us turn even lead. more. Let's see how the old pro handles And that's going to send us into the lead. Uh, this is a really forgiving trap. It's so wide. Uh, it's re this is really nice. Boy, you can tell Doug to Hudson's having the time of his life out there, out there today. And using the car on the outside again. To help us, and we're in the lead lap for 12 on champion difficulty as well. Oh, this this is nice. Doc Hudson sure keeps all no the time, and for one more race, he's gonna go and win it, win the Piston Cup. And yeah, we're just able to keep our speed, keep our momentum. Traffic cars opposing an issue of anything. Fans, today's race is sponsored by like Nitro Eight. Nitro Eight. High energy speed. drink. Although, to be fair, since we're not going car. up into the wall without. Uh, if we're not, since we're not going up into the wall, Calm and collect. probably the cars just on the outside just and actually just slowing us down since we can just keep the momentum going without hitting car on the outside. Doug and so we turn. On but hey, I don't mind. Champion difficulty, lap 5 out of 12, and we're still in the lead. Very little. Yeah. Oh, uh, actually, we might. someone's coming up on our inside, gets past the us. The official sponsor of the we Piston Cup speed Series there, is So Doug yeah, this race you. is not done and just out. And we also reset the track there. Would have not been fun. I'm sitting at 12 right at the midway point. I'm gonna dive straight and hold the inside line over here. Oh, man. Look out! out to them. Turn Lucky, and bank did some rubbing, but neither would give an inch. And this is genuinely, by the way, this is genuinely my first attempt. And we're at lap 6 out of 12, and we're in the lead. And honestly, I'm feeling pretty confident of winning. Don't get me wrong, it's a guaranteed win. And but here's I'm Doug feeling Hudson pretty good the about this. As we keep going down the inside, and we're able to stick it through the corner. Well, you give it too much time, boy. Off you're a in the tulip. In the lead. And this is really looking good for us. And we're just able to keep our speed and keep our momentum through the corners, whether it's because the, you know, the lapped cars they they help us turn, or we just have, have so much space we can just turn regardless and keep our speed up. Either way, it helps us. And if I can start taking better corners, ooh, that's not traffic, yeah, that's gonna slow me down a lot. If something like that happens on the last corner, as we drop down into third, we're definitely Watch gonna out. end up losing. After, but I went into the wall, so <laughs> I hope this at least. And, oh wow, that's our, that almost put this a second lead from them going into the wall. We might end up in the wall. All here. that time away from the track yeah, hasn't hurt Doc the, this, one the, bit. The corner is so banged, it helps us turn so much. <laughs> almost into the wall, the car almost was in the wall. Magic to hold it. Half a second in the lead lap, 8 out of 12, and this is honestly. Such a chill drive. The fabulous Hudson Hornet proving he's got what All it takes. All that time away I mean, from the track hasn't hurt Doc one not bit. Not proving what, what, that he has what it takes. Just proof uh -huh. that he can come back Where and you still do drive? it and still win. Hey, like call nine out twelve. A racer. Just barely in the lead. Oh, as, yeah, his car it came on our inside. That's uh, I forgot the names. Well, oh, he was zoomed into too much trouble, boy. You're in the, the tulip. Down at least because the black car slowed us down. And 
down to the inside. It might have been over 50 years since Doc raced last, but you'd never know it. Look at him fly. Yeah, over 50 years and we're still out here winning races, and that shows you, man. Motivation. Don't let uh, don't let age stop you. We're turning into a motivational YouTube channel now. We're gonna go to the inside. Now. Oh, we're getting circled up by traffic for a half a second. Lead. We're getting chased down a lot. Chick Hicks trying to send us in the wall. Sends us into the wall after he gave us a bump that speeds what? us up. I've, uh, oh wow, we're we're squashed here between the wall, Chick Hicks, and the car behind us. Luckily, God we got some room. Be and we've got the bank to we'll see if he can't reclaim us. that go down spot. to the inside. We're gonna keep sticking it down to the inside. Go, go, go around. Lap 10 out of 12. About to start lap 11. Come on. And there's all to play for here. So we're just barely in the lead. On the penultimate lap of the race. This is a really bad, really bad Stay line. In, in fact, room, it went buddy. to the That's wall. Luckily, it slow us down. It was barely. We got lucky. It didn't slow us down. They're gonna slick it around the outside of here. Dark Hutch and dropping the inside. And I might just, I'm going to hold it around the outside, hopefully keep some momentum up and keeps the speed up, which it does really nicely. And we're getting a really nice exit on the corner here. Come and collect. The final lap of the race, just lap 12 out of 12. Go. We're you a second in the lead. Him. And if we can keep this up, the win is going to be ours. We have to make sure not to hit any tra lap traffic, because that could really slow oh, us down. Yeah. Over a second and a half, things are going really well for us. Uh, in second place, they must be slowed down a little by the well, traffic. Final lap of the race, over two seconds in the lead. And this is genuinely champion difficulty, by the way. Just like last race with the King. And the fabulous Hudson Horn comes on the front stretch one more good, time with a two and a half second, almost a three second lead, and, and wins the Pistic Cup in one take. Short group comes in second. We don't have the best lap of the race, funnily enough. Uh, second, third, and fourth all have better laps than us, but we still come home to take the win. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the fabulous Hudson Hornet, seeing Doc Hudson coming back for one more race, coming out of retirement and winning the Piston Cup. And what's this? By God, the fabulous Hudson Hornet has come oh, back for one Alex. more race in Just the Piston watch, Cup. Go. Can the fabulous Hudson Hornet win the Piston Cup yet again, one more and time? Here's Doc Hudson the we needle. are here at Los Angeles National Speedway. And Boy, you can Doc tell Hudson Doc Hudson's having the time in one of his lap, lap out uh, there Just today. over a second and uh, less than a second and a half away from the lead. Already in one lap, we're about to move up into, uh -huh. Where did into you learn fourth. Okay, so I'm confused here. Um, so the King had way, way worse handling than Doc Hudson, which makes sense. The why I'm saying what the reason why I'm saying it's hey, confusing as we're in champion prove. difficulty and we're about and we're in the lead already on lap two. Something which we really struggled to do with the king. Um, the reason why I say it's confusing is because Looks Doc's like Doc handling Hudson stat is, stuck in is actually lower. No, he found a hole and got through it. The kings. And originally I thought that maybe it's because we had first race at. Um, at the other track, I can't remember its name right now. Uh -huh. And I, 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 was that Paul Miles Speedway? I think we were at Paul Miles Speedway. I originally was thinking it was because of that, because the corners were way more banged through, they had way more room to turn. And we're two. Se and here we are on lap three, two seconds in the lead. And yeah, Doc Hudson had a two set for handling, and the King had a three set for handling. So I just thought, as we're getting pushed wide here that you know, it was because of the track and you know Doc actually had worse handling and it was just feeling better because of how the track layout was but in reality Doc's turning is just way better and we're just able to keep our momentum so much more keep our speed up so much easier and have a much less issue with the, with the traffic uh, and even if we have an issue with them we're just able to go through the corners so much better so much faster and yeah, All that time away from the track hasn't hurt Doc one bit. Lap four out of twelve, and we're less IS than two and a half seconds in the lead. So I don't know why, how this makes sense, because uh, Doc Hudson Looks and the like King, 84 they had the same speed back. stat, they if had this the same acceleration he'll be well stat. Out they go continue. around the outside, right up to the wall there, Calm almost and getting collected. into it. Just and watch Doc go. Like I said, one less handling stat, so I thought that if anything, find it even harder ah. to go around this track because the King. With the king, we, we were circling slightly with handling, and no, he had one nice more race. better stat for stability. The king had three, and Doc Hudson had four, if I Calm believe. and collected. Just uh, watch Doc go. Might, I think the king might have had four, and Doc Hudson might have had five. But I think it was the king had three, and Doc Hudson had four. 
and I don't see why, how that would affect handling. Maybe it is. You can always tell um, when a racer's doing good, because he's having fun passing cars I don't know left what's and what. Right. All I know is that I'm enjoying this race. We're about to hit lap 6 out of 12, Calm and we and are almost, and we are second, slightly go. over a second and a half in the Looks lead. Looks like Doc Hudson is stuck in and traffic. As a, as a, no, as a he found motto, a hole and got uh, through it. Above us playing the cars game, ain't nobody can stop us except ourselves. And that is quite the case. Don't be wrong, we are losing a bit of time slowly, slowly. I mean, we were, we were like two seconds in the lead, and now we're slightly under a second and a half in the lead. So probably by the time we get to like lap... Uh, and oh, actually, we're up into the wall. We're up into the wall, we're up into the wall. we can't get out of the wall. Again. I was going to say, maybe by the time we get to lap eight, we might be getting a challenge from the cars, you know, who are in second. Maybe they might try to move for the lead, but we're up into the wall there, Number and we are barely in the lead now, so we might today. get challenged, but they seem to have gone slow down you can a lot tell by traffic, what a and we're back good, to almost the second in the lead. Fun, cars left and left and right. now 12, and this is why he is the fabulous Hudson Hornet. You might want to take notes on this one. Oh, we yeah, I am taking notes, because he is such a good drive. Almost hitting 20 miles per hour as well. We almost going to get into the wall actually, but doesn't slow us down. We're over two seconds in the lead. So wow. I was gonna uh, there was a Boy, word I was you can tell for. Doc Hudson's having a Oh wow, we got spun out. We got today. spun out. Lap eight out of twelve. We got reset the track as well. We've here. just lost the whole of speed as the cars drive through us. Oh. And we are luck uh, just under a second off the lead. Luckily they get slowed low down by traffic and we have free space on the inside. And hey, we're able to got move past to Chick Hicks, Shoregrip and Hollister. Hollister zooming way in the lead. And we're going to need to play some major catch up here with only only a few ah. laps to go. And we're losing time here uh, over a second away from the lead. Oh, we're in right. second place. Shoregrip right behind us. Hollister is there though. And we need to do some major catch up. We're actually losing time to Hollister. At back up. Could we actually lose this race now? We're the fabulous what? Hudson Hornet. We're gonna come back. We're gonna win this race, and we're gonna catch up to Hollister. So oh. I'm just losing more time to him, and this traffic's slowing me down even more. Lap nine out of twelve, and they could be being proved an issue here, as we're just losing time to Hollister. He's over two seconds in the lead. No, no, it's just under two seconds in the lead. And can we do anything to catch up? Oh. Almost into the wall yet again. We're oh, we're more than two seconds away from the lead. And we're about to hit lap 10 Doug out of 12. Holl on a roll. Hollister's not being slowed down by traffic at all. Uh -huh. We're keeping our speed up and we're taking good lines. We're managing to keep on top and we're not being able to gain any time Tom on him. And, and this is going to just be watch problematic. I'm trying to keep my speed up. I'm trying to keep my momentum up. But Hollister's just going so quick. And we're just losing Doug time to him. This makes no roll. sense. We're going so fast. Well, you give it too much song, boy. You're in the tulips. And Hollister's just zooming away. He's just Wait. zooming away, lap 11 out of 12. We are able to finally gain a bit of time on, it, on him. I think he went up into the wall or something. Uh, we hit traffic there. And we're now gaining a lot of time. We're less than a second and a half away from Hollister. And here's Doug Hudson. And we're gaining and we're gaining. And thankfully, because we're about to come to the final lap of the race. And we're going to hopefully mount... A serious comeback for the lead, a ser sorry, a serious challenge for the lead, hopefully. The Hollister is less than half a second away from us. We go a bit of a boost from second mm. place. We're going quite slow. Hollister is gaining on us, and we're about to hit the final lap of the race. And we are over a se oh, less than a second away from the lead. Hollister, as we're outside, we go down the inside. We're into the and lead. Medford lap 12 right out of 12. Can we hold he it? Seems all right. He'll I think the commentator said Hollister went up into the wall, which is going to give us a significant advantage. All that we get slowed away from by the traffic, but not enough to be losing bit. any time. I'm going to go to the outside over here. And like I said, you know how we said nothing can stop us except ourselves? We did get spun out by traffic, but it was probably because we turned into traffic. And on the final lap, the fabulous Hudson Hart manages to pull out an amazing gap and manages to win. We managed to win by an uh, over two second no. gap, and we still go on to win the Piston Cup with the fabulous Hudson Hornet. Hollister and Lee Jr. with a combined fastest lap with Shore Grip right behind them. And we get a combined fastest lap with Chick Hicks. Um, that mean, didn't make much sense. Hollister and Lee Jr. had the fastest lap.
which is a combined fast lap, and then Churgrip came right behind him, which is almost an identical lap time as well, and we had an identical lap time to check Hicks. But we have won the Piston Cup twice in a row with the fabulous Hudson Hornet on Palmer Speedway and on Los uh, and on Los I can't speak and on Los Angeles International Speedway, both on champion difficulty. And I hope you guys enjoyed. These have been really fun races to do. Please leave a like and subscribe. And this has been Turbo Kyle and Godspeed.